Well, it's been hours now since last night's launch for the Gordon Bennett and America's Challenge gas balloon races, but many balloons are still hovering nearby when they should be miles and miles away from Albuquerque. News 13's Caitlin McCarthy is live at Balloon Fiesta Park to explain why. Caitlin? Well, here in the command center, the gas pilots from both races call in to check the weather as officials use GPS to track where they are in the sky. Meteorologists at the command center say the balloons didn't get too far yet because they took off last night when there were light winds and they've not yet picked up. Right now, the furthest Gordon Bennett racer is about 80 miles north and the furthest America's Challenge balloon is about 45, 45 miles rather north of Albuquerque. Meteorologists say the pilots are trying to work their way north hoping to catch stronger winds that will take them east at faster speeds. This year with the gas race is unique because uh, typically they take off in, in faster winds, where this year they took off in a, in a high pressure system, kind of in the center of a, a circulation system. So they're not going any one particular direction. In fact, last night they just basically did a circle down to the south and came right back up to Albuquerque. The main goal here at the command center is safety for the pilots. That's why officials are carefully monitoring the weather, and hopefully those balloons will catch the winds and move further away. Reporting live at Balloon Fiesta Park, I'm Caitlin McCarthy. Back to you. An unusual turn of events there. Thank you, Caitlin. Now, you can track the gas balloon race from our website, krqe.com. It's pretty cool stuff. And there you can also find a schedule of events at Balloon Fiesta Park. Upload your favorite Balloon Fiesta pictures, and you also have access to our webcams out there.